Okay, now you see the example number 49. Hindustan Limited obtained a lease. They obtained a lease means they have taken the lease from coal company for a coal mine. Hindustan Limited obtained a lease means they are the receivers of the lease. Taken the lease means they are the lessee. Lessee. And coal company is the owner. Coal company is the owner. Therefore, they are called as lesser. Date of agreement is 1-1-2003. Rate of royalty is rupee 1 per ton coal risk. Rate is 1 rupee. First point clear. Second point, minimum rent. Minimum rent rupee is 12,000 per annum. Minimum rent is 12,000 per annum. Second point is clear. And third point, recoupment of short working during the next three years. Three years period is given. Next three years period is there. It is floating time. And subject to a maximum of rupees 2,500 per annum. Maximum rupees 2,500 per annum is the limit. Maximum limit. In this point, there are two conditions. First condition is you are permitted to recover the short working in the next three years. And you are permitted to recover maximum 2,500, not more than 2,500. This is the point, remember. And regarding the strike and lockouts, in the event of strike, minimum rent is to be, minimum rent would be taken pro rata on the basis of actual working days, on the basis of actual working days. You see this point, the strike period, you see the strike. Strike is in the year 2007. In the year 2007, strike is for 73 days. And 73 days minimum rent is to be reduced. Okay. Minimum rent is to be reduced. There are 365 days. Out of 365 days, 73 days are the period related to strike. Okay. You deduct 73 days from 365 days. That means 365 minus 73 is equal to 282. 282 days are working days. Sorry, 292 days. 290 days, two days are the working days. So on the basis of pro rata, you have to calculate the minimum rent for 2007. And one more point is there. But in the event of lockout, in the event of lockout, lease rent enjoys a concession in respect of minimum rent for 50% for the period of minimum rent for the period of strike, uh, for the period of lock, uh, lockout. During the period of lockout, if there is a lockout, during the period of lockout, there is a concession in the minimum rent for 50% of the period of minimum rent. Minimum period. 50% of the period. 50% of the period, not full. Okay. You see here, there is a four month strike. In the year 2008, four month strike. Four months uh, lockout is there. Four month lockout is there. And 50% concession in the minimum rent will be allowable. Therefore, first you have to calculate rent for four months. Minimum rent is 12,000 per annum. And minimum rent for four months is, I think it is 4,000. 4,000 is the minimum rent for four months. And uh, concession is 50%. 50% 50 of 4,000 is 2,000. 2,000. Okay. And they will give 2,000 concession in the period of lockout. And minimum rent for the year 2008 is 12,000 minus concession. Concession is 2,000. Then minimum rent for the year 2008 is 10,000. Like this, you have to calculate. I'll show it. Okay. Clear? What is the rate of royalty? Rupee 1, first point. Second, minimum rent 12,000. Third, short working recovery. Next three years, maximum 2,500. Third point, in, during the strike, proportionate reduction. During the lockout, concession. These points you remember and prepare the chart. 
2003 to 2008 uh, royalty is given there is no need of calculation of rupees royalty is given rate of royalty is given and royalty is be one per ton actual royalty is given in the problem and output is also same because if you divide it by 1 rupee itself will become the output okay you see the chart minimum rent for 2007 is equal to 12000 into 292 days are the working days 292 days are the working divided by total number of days 365 okay you see here working period is equal to for 2007 is equal to 365 minus 73 days strike period so the minimum rent for 2007 is 9600 and you remember proposed net reduction is made and concession in the minimum rent for 4 months is equal to 12000 is the annual rent into 4 by 12 into 4 by 12 is the uh, rent for lockout period you multiply by 4 divide by 12 divide by 12 you will get monthly rent 4 months rent it is the 4 month rent into 50% concession 50% of this is 2000 so concession given to you people in case of lockout is 2000 therefore minimum rent for 2008 is equal to 12000 minus concession concession is 2000 so minimum rent for 2008 is 10000 these two points you remember and prepare the chart royalty chart you see this this is the date this is the date and this is the output this is the output output and amount are also same rate 1 rupee is there okay royalty same royalty and output are same royalty in rupees is given in the problem therefore you can leave the first column and second column i'm sorry output and rate directly you take the rate column you see here date column output and rate i have i will not consider because royalty amount is given in the problem royalty amount is given in the problem there is no need of these two columns you don't draw these two columns 7000 first year royalty second second year 10200 third year 16100 fourth year 13600 and 2007 10800 last year 9700 this is the royalty amount given in the problem therefore there is no need of drawing the output and rate column rate of royalty then you write the minimum rent 12000 12000 12000 12000 and 2007 uh, minimum rent is 9600 okay and for 2008 minimum rent is 10000 as already calculated then you calculate excess first year no second year no third year 4100 next year 1600 here 1200 last year no now short working first year 5000 second year 1800 third year no third year fourth year nil fifth year nil sixth year there is short working of 300 short working of 300 okay short working recovery short working recovery time given is 3 years time given is 3 years this 5000 is to be recovered in the next 3 years means 2004 2005 2006 okay first year not possible second year also not possible third year 4100 is the excess but 
but you are permitted to recover maximum 2500 okay 2500 2500 you have to recover clear and <clears throat> you see here out of 5000 you recover 2500 in this stage and one more year is there for your recovery next three years ends on 2000 6 in some 2006 and out of 5000 you recover 2500 and here 1600 is the excess you recover 1600 3 years period completed for this 5000 for this 5000 3 year period completed 1 2 3 because here excess is here but there is a maximum limit here amount is only 1600 therefore 1600 recovered okay 2500 1600 recovered out of 5000 and remaining 900 is recovered because time given completed time given completed okay next is 1800 this 1800 is to be recovered in the next 3 years in the next 3 years first year second year third year here and here 1200 is the excess you recover 1200 out of 1 1800 you recovered 1200 in the next 3 years in the next 3 years and remaining balance of 600 is he recovered because time given completed time given completed and this 300 is to be recovered in the next 3 years next 3 years okay for next years it may be recovered in the 2009 10 or 11 this is point you remember and payment column royalty plus sw minus swr royalty plus sw minus swr royalty plus sw minus swr Royalty plus SW minus SWR. Royalty plus SW minus SWR. Nine thousand six hundred. Royalty plus SW minus SWR. Ten thousand. Okay, this is the royalty chart. Okay, now we prepare the accounts. First is ledger accounts in the books of Industrial Limited. Royalty account. Debit side, you write the year and date. Credit side, you write the year and date. Debit side to lesser name. Credit side by P and L. Amount from royalty column. You see here. First year, coal company is the lesser. Seven thousand royalty. P and L account seven thousand. Total seven thousand. Second year, coal company. Ten thousand two hundred royalty, by payable account, ten thousand two hundred total, ten thousand two hundred. Third year, two coal company account, sixteen thousand one hundred, by payable account, sixteen thousand one hundred total, sixteen thousand one hundred. Two coal company account, thirteen thousand six hundred, by payable account, thirteen thousand six hundred total. Thirteen thousand six hundred. Next, to coal company account ten thousand eight hundred by PNL account ten thousand eight hundred. Total ten thousand eight hundred. Last year, to coal company account nine thousand seven hundred by PNL account nine thousand seven hundred. Total nine thousand seven hundred. You see this debit side lesser name amount royalty column amount. Credit side, P and L account, royalty column amount. Remember this point. Next, coal company account. Coal company means lesser. In this account, debit side to bank, debit amount, payment column. Credit side by royalty, royalty column amount. Close the account. Balance is to be short working. See here. To bank twelve thousand by royalty seven thousand total twelve thousand difference five thousand short working 
thirty first twelve to bank account twelve thousand wife royalty twelve ten thousand two hundred total twelve thousand difference one thousand eight hundred by short working account to bank account payment thirteen thousand six hundred by royalty sixteen thousand one hundred total sixteen thousand one hundred difference two thousand five hundred to short working to bank account twelve thousand by royalty account thirteen thousand six hundred total thirteen thousand six hundred difference one thousand six hundred to short working account next year to bank account payment Nine thousand six hundred. By royalty, ten thousand eight hundred. Difference, one thousand two hundred. Too short working. Last year, to bank account, ten thousand. By royalty, nine thousand seven hundred. Total, ten thousand. Difference, three hundred. This is short working. Okay. Debit side, you write to bank amount, payment column. Credit side you write by royalty amount royalty column. Take the total difference right as short working debit or credit. If there is no difference, no problem. Next account short working account. In the short working account, you consider three column: S W, S W R, S W I R. S W R debit side lesser. S W R credit side lesser. S <laughs> W I R credit side P N account. Remember this. To coal company account S W five thousand. S W R S W I R no amount. So by balance carried on five thousand. By balance carried on five thousand. To balance brought down five thousand. First year complete. Second year again S W is there. Debit side to coal company one thousand eight hundred. Credit side there is no item. That is no S W R, no S W I R. By balance carried down six thousand eight hundred. Total six thousand eight hundred. Two balance brought down six thousand eight hundred. Okay. Third year balance. In the third year, there is amount in the S W R column. So you take as by coal company. This is S W R amount two thousand five hundred. Close the account. Assert in the balance. Balance is four thousand three hundred. Four thousand three hundred balance. Two balance brought down four thousand three hundred. Four thousand three hundred is the two balance brought down. Then in the third year. Again, there is a S W R amount. In the S W R amount, one thousand six hundred, and there is a P N L account. S W I R nine hundred. These two amounts are one thousand six hundred in the S W R, nine hundred is in the S W I R column. So, by coal company for S W R, by P N L account for S W I R. Close the account and assert in the balance. Four thousand three hundred total. By balance carried down one thousand eight hundred. Two balance brought down one thousand eight hundred. Again, S W R column. One thousand two hundred is there. And by P N account eight hundred is there. S W R one thousand two hundred. S W I R eight hundred. You write these two and as. <coughs> Take the balance. Wait, wait.
whole company account is 1200 and uh, PNL account is 600, not 800. It is 600. Uh, wrongly spelled. 1800 total, 1800 total, both sides. There's no balance. And in the last year, SW column amount is there. So to whole company account, 300. And SWR, SWIR column, there is no amount. Therefore, you take as buy balance carried down, 300. Total 300. This will be recovered in the coming years. Okay, this is the problem. You go through the problem once again.